हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू माय न्यू वीडियो सो बेसिकली इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट हाउ यू विल डू ए फाइल अपलोड यूजिंग जावा जावा स्प्रिंग बोर्ड सो इन ए स्प्रिंग बोर्ड एप्लीकेशन आफ्टर वी आर क्रिएटिंग द एप्लीकेशन वी हैव दिस काइंड ऑफ स्ट्रक्चर सो दिस एक्चुअली ए स्प्रिंग बोर्ड एप्लीकेशन ऑटोशन विद स्प्रिंग बोर्ड एक्चुअल स्प्रिंग बोर्ड एप्लीकेशन Uh, syntax and I have a main package name. So here I'm going to create a package here for our file upload operation. So I need to create a controller package, probably a service package also. So we will do the controller first. Then we will uh, we will do the service after that. So. I would like to mention the file controller that will be better in this scenario and I'm going to add another package here that's service so service I need to add some file file service or something file storage service or something like that Probably file storage will be a nice name and I need to service. Okay, so this, this is the only things that I need right now and other than that we have some something to mention here also the path for uploading the file. So we will start with the first thing. So creating a controller. So I need I probably copy paste something from other uh, code in this scenario. So I have a file storage service somewhere around uh, in my code. So I will copy paste that to this application, and then we will go further from that. So here uh, I need to create the file storage service that already I have and uh, I need to mention it as a service. So probably this video will take one of two more videos because uh, basically it will take some time to implement all of these things. So just copying some of the th things from my previous application so here is the thing so i need to import file path and here file storage properties i didn't have any house like file storage properties so here what i'm going to do is we will create a configuration package so this is for a properties so basically the file storage path we are going to store there so here if i am mentioning like file storage for that particular class that's enough so in that class what we uh, what we will uh, what we will mention in that class is just a minute i need to go back to my previous application where um, where it's mentioned what we actually need in that class so here just the upload directory so we will copy some other stuff from that application again and here I have only one thing so here this is the thing that I need and here we can use this one called generate cater and setter okay so it's so it's saying like some issues or something that's probably will go after we are doing our step okay so here I need 
I need to import some other classes also. Java in new file files or something like that and also input class. So what is actually happening here? So I am creating an auto weight um, auto weight instance of a particular things. I mean what I am going to do is I am going to create a file storage location here. I am not aware that file storage of DC. So file storage file storage service actually. So in this one the file storage location path to get I'm taking path from file storage properties and converting into absolute path and normally so just just we are and we just we are taking the path from this file storage location so that's the only thing do here and we have an exception class also i will i will add a, an exception class in somewhere in this package after some times so probably i will do that right away so otherwise probably we will miss things after some time so this also i'm going to copy from some other application because already that application running in my system so it's very easy to do that things so here exception need to create the file storage exception and then we will copy some other things from that application. So here I copy something and saying like some issues or something. We don't need to care about that right now. Just just import. So here, this part is here, and we are not facing any issues here. Here we have some like, uh, yeah, that's related to this cache class. And also standard copy option with this access pin. We will go through all these things in my next video. Thank you for watching and the next thing what we are planning to do is creating a control class the file storage class is already we defined so we are fine we just need a file from control class and I, we need to test the overall system so that's we are going to do in our next video thank you for watching have a nice day